Kia ora. I'm going to go over how to install the amazing plugin Ladybug. Um, we've created an installer for you so it makes life a little bit easier. So if you go to Nuku and then under Tie Our Project, I've set up some projects for some resources for this project. Um, and there's one titled Ladybug Tools, which I've got open here. Um, and a quick description of what Ladybug can do. Um, that's very uh, simplistic uh, description. It's very, very powerful and a, and a great piece of, of uh, software. Um, here we've got uh, the file to download. So we click, uh, if you click on the little arrow there, it will download it automatically. So I've downloaded it uh, here. Uh, just depending on what your computer, how your computer's set up, some of you that might uh, automatically unzip that file um, and you'll just be left with a folder. Uh, others you may need to uh, unzip it or extract it. So on the Mac computer, you can if it hasn't already, you can just double click on it. You can see it's it's unzipped it. If you're on a Windows computer, you might need to right click on that in the File Explorer and go Extract, and then it will pull that out. And then here we've got. Uh, the a grasshopper file that we're going to quickly open up uh, and install. This may take a while, so we'll, let's um, just open it. So I've got grasshopper here uh, open. So if we go file, open document, and then go to that ladybug installer, and then open this file, uh, and it will sit there and start doing a whole lot of stuff. So we just need to be patient. I'm going to pause the video for a second and we'll come back once it's done everything that it's done. Okay, so that took a couple minutes, so just be be warned that it can take a while. So uh, it comes up and says installation successful, Ladybug Tools 1.8 has been successfully installed. Uh, restart Rhino to load the new components and library. So we can go OK. Let it do its thing. Okay. Um, basically, that's just given us instruction on what's going on. Uh, you can have a look at that if you want, uh, but you don't need to. So I'm going to close that. And quit Rhinoceros. And then let's open Rhino again. So what, uh, just while that's opening, it's created some folders on your computer. So in my case here, uh, under the, my username, it's created a folder called Ladybug Tools and then installed Python and some other resources. And it's installed a couple of other uh, bits of software as well that Ladybug uses to do some of the analysis. And just so you're aware, uh, new model, uh, you'll be using Ladybug uh, next trimester as well and then next year as well. So this is giving you a bit of an introduction to it. Let's just see if we open that up. Uh, now you should see uh, I've got Honeybee that's part of it, Dragonfly, uh, Radiance and Ladybug. I've got some other ones, just ignore those. The key one that we need to deal with is Ladybug and then we've got some other uh, tutorials on how to sort of start using that. 